Hey yo, what's up guys? It's your boy Seth Drop Bits and I'm back with another video. Today I want to show you guys an amazing app that turns your phone into a MIDI controller with FL Studio. Let's check it out. Shorty call and ask me where I've been. I've been working on myself. Sometimes you are away from your system but you want to create music. You don't have your MIDI controller with you but you have your laptop. This app can be very useful in those situations when you want to create melodies but you are away from the system, okay? If you are like me, you like having your hands busy when creating because, you know, using my mouse when creating music just feels like checking emails. I don't enjoy it much, okay? But if that's your way of producing music, no shade at oh okay the app name is image line remote it's available on apple store and android which is google play store okay let's go ahead and download the app okay okay so what you're going to do you're going to type image line remote mine is already installed after installing you're going to hit open Hit open. As you can see, it says image line remote Wi-Fi MIDI controller for FL Studio. Okay. So this means the PC you will be using has to be connected over the same Wi-Fi with your smartphone. Because the app uses Wi-Fi to send signal to your FL Studio. Okay. Now that the app is open, we're going to hit tap to connect, which is FL Studio. Okay, as you can see over here, you have your main options, which is your song pattern mode, your play pause, your stop record, metronome, tap tempo, um, wait for input over dub. You also have your tempo notch up and down. You have your settings, your mixer, your browser, your piano roll, your step sequencer, your show playlist. Okay, and over here, there are tabs you can switch to piano, to FPC to harmonics, to slides X, um, to play chops, to performance, and to mix. With this, you can control the mixer on your laptop or desktop, okay? So let's go ahead and connect this. As you can see, when I play, nothing happens, but my FL Studio is open. So let's go ahead and select options, select MIDI settings, okay? And go to enable image line remote. Let's hit enable. Okay, it pops up. FL Studio Remote, Huawei, that's my phone. I'm using a Huawei P30, um, and that is my phone over here. I just hit Enable. Let's test it out. Let's go straight to the piano. Oh, okay, where's my headphones? Right, let's play. Okay. You can use this knob over here to switch between instruments. Okay, so let's go to the FPC. Okay, come on, man. Yep. Okay, let me show it to you. So this is the FPC. Okay, let's go to the main. Let's show mixer. Okay, and then we can control. Okay, as you can see, it's in sync. Okay, the first two tracks were already adjusted and they show up like this. Check it out. Even if I use my laptop or desktop, it's still in sync with the app. Okay, so let's go ahead and check out more options okay you have your record you have your metronome let's play hit play switch on metronome switch it off switch it on tempo nudge okay let's use this one to adjust the tempo okay there is a digital wheel over here All right, you want to view a browser, switch it off, piano roll, switch it off, step sequencer, on and off, okay, 
a show playlist to arrange. Great stuff. So let's go to the first sound using the target channel button, okay? Let's play. Okay, let's try to record something here. Eh? I'm gonna hit record, go to my piano. All right, let's go to main, stop, play. Use my mouse real quick. Just quantize, quantize, drag this to the first bar, okay? Now let's play using the MIDI controller. Play. Line. All right. All right. I'm gonna use my mouse just to duplicate this as it is. Okay, my screen is not that big, so the words are a bit small for me. Um, but if you have a tablet, oh man, you're in a good space. You're in a good space, okay? So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna hit stop, play again. Stop, okay? Let's go to the piano. So let's go to the snare clap. Yep. Main, let's hit play. Right, let's hit stop. If you're enjoying this video and you're finding some value, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Let's get back to it. Record, play. All right, let's hit stop. Let's hear it. Stop, disable record, let's play. Show piano row. Let's quantize. Control Q. Let's add some my ads. No, no. Hi ads. Hi ads. Hi ads. Let's go. Right, stop, hit record, play piano. Hit stop, show piano roll, let's play that. Disable record, play. Yeah, well, yeah. Na 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 Okay, let's send this 20 tracks. Go to my mixer. Turn it up. Turn down the snare. Turn on the sound. Alright, let's look for another sound. Let's remove the mixer, mixer, off, mixer, off, <laughs> off. Let's stop, uh, look for an 808, let's go to the 808, um, with the mouse it's, it's a bit faster, okay. Uh, let's go straight to the 808. All right, let's hit play.
yeah na 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 record that 808 record <laughs> All right, let's stretch it I think we went too crazy with chopping off the TK and sustain eh let's give it some breath oh yeah 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 well yeah well yeah 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 well yeah yeah boy yeah 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 yeah, yeah. And there is a lot more you can do with this app. It's a super cool app, man. And it's mobile. It's on your phone. All you need to do, download the app. Make sure the PC is connected to the same internet. Go to options, media settings, enable fruity remote, select your phone, and you're good to go, man. And that's it for this one. My name is Cetro Beats, and I'm out. Shawty call and ask me where I been. I been working on myself. Shawty call and ask me where I been. I been working on myself. She gon' probably ask me who I'm with. I been working with.